On to Sri Lanka now. The financial crisis there continues to spiral. In the latest, the President Gotabaya Rajapaksa has pleaded for international assistance to help the country deal with its worst economic crisis. Rajapaksa virtually spoke at the World Economic Forum in Davos. He said that immediate help was needed to import essential medicines, food and fuel. The country lacks the financial ability to buy necessary products and pay debts. People in Sri Lanka blame the government for worsening economic situation and continue to demand President Gotabaya's resignation. The virtual shutting down of the tourism industry and the sharp decline in inward remittances from expatriate workers due to COVID-19 in the past two years an increasing inflation due to other events combined with Sri Lanka's high outstanding debt obligations to cause a severe financial crisis. As we work through such solutions, however, we urgently require the assistance of our friends in the international community to ensure that our immediate needs in terms of the importation of essential medicines, food supply and fuel army. Meanwhile, Sri Lanka made a request to Russia to purchase petroleum products. This is according to the Russian embassy in Sri Lanka. Russia is considering Sri Lanka's request and supports the process. According to reports, a meeting was held between the Russian ambassador to Sri Lanka and Sri Lanka's Minister of Energy on the matter. However, the first secretary to the Russian embassy has denied these reports. Sri Lanka has reached out to several countries for help. This comes as the country continues to deal with shortage of fuel, food and medicines. <laughs> We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.